What's up everyone? This is Atesh. Welcome back to a brand new video. Uh, today I'll be doing a last of us challenge uh, around Monza with an Alpine in F1 2021. And before we get into the race, uh, I've used two mods for this video. One is uh, F1 2022 sounds. This is a really good mod. You can get the 2022 car sounds in F1 2021 game and the 2022 season mod. This changes a little bit of physics and also it adjusts the car performance based on the 2022 teams, the current world champion teams. So if you guys uh, want to download these two mods, these are these both are free. You can just download and copy paste it in your game directory. I've leave the links in the description below. And without wasting any of any other time so before that I've added an uh, one more extra camera in the video uh, the outside camera so that you can see the cars from the outside so I hope you guys like it and wait for the lights five red lights and the way we go uh, pretty good launch I would say but however it's Monza T1 so I have to be a bit careful and the only aim now is to cross uh, T1 without any damage to just get this lap one down without any damage. As you can see a little bit of uh, touching here and there. And I get a warning for collision with Sonoda. Turn 2, turn 3. We are now uh, going into turn 4. Now we dive up on the inside of Sonoda. Break late. Uh, second gear. Short shift to third, and I had to lift off there because you know Ocon was so close to me. And then now break at the 50 meter mark, and then just turn right, fifth gear, up shift to sixth, then down shift to fourth, and quick shift to fifth. And I got a really nice uh, drive there, so I was pushing really hard now because uh, uh, I had to gain much more places. Uh, I had to gain as many places as possible in lap one because uh, that's important because once you know everyone gets settled in the race it's difficult to pass all the cars and add only 13 laps so i have to make the most of it we are now at the last corner break after the 50 meter mark just before the drs detection line i guess and down shift to fourth or fifth then up shift to six seven eight and now it's you're in the top the 10 now straight. keep it up so at the end of lap 1 we are P10 and we have Gasly right in front of us and I have my teammate behind me. Two uh, turns 1 and 2 we go. Uh, this is turn 3 which is uh, absolutely flat. It's, it's not even turn in a fun class. This is turn 3 now we go turn 4. The one thing I noticed here is that the AI was pretty slow. Uh, in these uh, couple of corners i don't know why yeah was a bit slow and yeah i have set the ai at uh, 90 the is 110 i've set at 90 just because you know it's a new engine mod i haven't uh, raised with this uh, mod settings at all so i don't know i didn't know how the car would perform so i kept it at 90 which was okay pretty good i would say it was uh, not too hard not too easy it was like okay it was a uh, medium Okay, good work, great pass. So, as you can see, the Alpine had no top speed whatsoever. Uh, the Arfatori had much more top speed though. And we had the inside line, so we break late, down to 5th gear, and then short shift to 6. Uh, not uh, this wide, you don't have to go this wide, you have to be careful. Because if you go DRS way too wide, you will get a warning for track limits. And we were on the back side, I'm in the slipstream of Leclerc. I I think I'll outbreak him, yeah, I'll outbreak him. And at this point, I thought I was gonna hit science, but luckily uh, the car stopped. The move was done. So, uh, lap 3, uh, till now, it's all, all, all it's good. To turn 4, we go. As you can see, the air is a bit slow. I'm catching all these cars, like from turn th this sector. Sector 2, the air is a bit slow. The sectors 1 and 3 AI is very fast, but down the sector 2 the AI is a bit slow. And as you can see, we will have DRS now. And I get a OK uh, exit and using the DRS and with also ERS. I just pass the uh, signs. 
The last corner is uh, it, it, it is a bit important because you have to get your breaking point straight because then next it, it's also a back straight so this corner depends on how much uh, top speed you can get so I was held up there a little bit by uh, Perez and Bottas as you can see you see the top speed of Red Bull is way too much I had DRS and also with DRS I was not able to catch Red Bull nor the Mercedes and we outbreak both of them I think someone bought us, I guess, just touched me a little bit. But I didn't get any damage, and I think he also didn't got any damage. And now I'm using ERS a little bit more just to get away from them because I know Red Bull and Mocha are a bit fast, so I just wanted to get uh, away from them. And downshift to third, picture to fourth. As uh, there, I was a bit in too deep, so. I was compromised at the exit, I tried to get early on power and I had a movement there. Now we send it here at Norris, I guess. No, it's Check your down. MFD for a new strategy option. And when, when, when I was driving, I didn't even, rec uh, didn't even, uh, like, my mind didn't register that uh, the Jeff said about strategy. I was so much focused on race, I didn't even hear that. So we are in, at lap 4, uh, on lap 4 we are in P4, which is uh, very very good, but as you can see the leader, I guess it's Verstappen, Verstappen already has around 4 or 5 seconds lead now, so I'll just uh, go inside of Hamilton there and I got, I got a pretty nice drive out of the final corner, using the DRS, Norris had no DRS so I had much more speed, this cost him on the back straight. Yeah, as you can see on the top right now this one and uh, Hamilton they're both fighting so now we are on lap 8 yeah we are on lap like, maybe this this might be my in lap for box, pit stop box. we're coming in this lap yeah, this is for my pit stop as you can see I've reduced the gap to now just 6 tenths and you break just after the 100 meters board downshift to second sometimes even first to get the rotation then quick shift up shift to third Esteban and is in the pits. and you just full on throttle it you just uh, go full throttle till uh, turn 4 as you can see even in sector 1 I was not able to catch West and here you can see I will gain much more time on him so break at the 100 meters mark down shift to third quick shift to fourth take the corner six uh, break at 50 meters board fifth get 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 the rotation nice and clean power on to 6, again break at 50 meters board, down shift to 4th or 5th, depends upon the speed, quick shift to quick shift 1 gear up and then full throttle, DRS open, and if you have if you've seen, the, uh, messed up and had a moment there, so he lost the drive there, which was a good thing for me, I could overtake him there. Nice move, good job. And uh, down the back side we come, so we took the lead in around 9 laps, which was Okay, I thought I could uh, get it a little bit early. I thought I would uh, get the lead by seven or eight laps. If it was the normal F121, I would have got ten at seven or eight laps. But with the mods, uh, there's a little bit change. And now we come into the pits. Verstappen comes into the pits. And now, if if you see on the top right corner. I had a slow pit stop go, go, go. and I just come right in front go, of us just, just right in front of us So that was it and then I managed uh, This is your final lap, the final lap of the race You can see on the last lap Verstappen was very very close to me He passed me on the straight but then I called him under braking Second gear, first gear Get the rotation nice and clean Second gear and then Full on throttle now I used a little bit of ERS sir. and then I saw the gap was uh, 4 tenths I, uh, which is okay because I can pull a couple of tenths uh, here in second sector too because I'm faster than the AI so down shift to third and then fourth, fifth, six. break at 50 meters get the rotation nice and clean uh, use the curb a little bit don't use much because again then your car will spin this is one of uh, the trickiest corner because it's very easy to lose your car there 
because if you turn in too quickly then you are on the grass if you turn in too late uh, you are on the gravel so you have to be careful there break after the 100 meters board turn shift to fifth take the inside curve uh, not full throttle you just have to be gentle on the throttle up shift to six and then as soon as you arrive at the exit full on throttle and then it's the last corner don't shift to uh, hit the apex there and go as wide as you can avoiding the clap limits up to 7th and 8th that's it that was it guys great job you've done everything we wanted today I hope you guys liked the video and yeah please do like share and subscribe thank you so much for joining see you guys in the next video here we are then a thoroughly deserved win in Italy after another excellent Grand Prix Here come today's winning drivers and what a race it was. This is a team that knows significant.